So here are a few things to consider before following this tutorial. First of all, this works for the iPhone 2G, 3G, 3GS, and the iPod Touch first and second generation. Mine here is an iPod Touch second generation. And that device needs to have White Door 7.1 installed. So assuming that you have White Door 7.1 installed, you gotta go to Safari, then type this URL, which I'll show right here. After clicking on go, it will lead you to this. And as you can see here, it says that you should sync with iTunes before using this tool. So get your computer. So you're gonna go to iTunes, then plug your iPod in, then it will show you this screen. Now you can slide to install. Then you're gonna need to copy this command right here. Click on copy. You're gonna go back to your home screen, go to the terminal, and before you type the command, you're gonna type SU. Like that, return. Once it asks you for your password, you're gonna type Alpine. I'll write it on the screen, return. There we are. And now you gotta add that command. But you can't just paste it directly. Now you're gonna slide up with two fingers. It's gonna get you this configuration. Click on menu gonna choose this one on the middle and now I'm just gonna paste the command there we are and then done now you go back and done for some reason the screen turns upside down then you're gonna have to restart your terminal if you have the iOS 7 style multitasking then I'd recommend you just switch it off to the manual multitasking by going to settings then white door settings features then switching the multitasking side so once that's done i'm gonna click back just to the terminal type su once again return password is alpine now you click on your middle command if you can't see this menu then you just gotta long press you're gonna click like this and then return Now you can restart your device. So you're just gonna long press the power button. And if you wanna know if this actually succeeded, look at the slide to power off menu. You can see that it's changed to a more modern style. So you're just gonna slide to power off. Then you long press the power button to turn it on. And there we go, we can see that the font of the clock has changed, and we can slide to unlock, and there we are, the icons have changed and you have successfully installed Lime Door on your device. Thank you guys for watching, a sub would be appreciated, and I hope this helped. And if you're having any problems, then do let me know in the comments section below. Peace.